Robbie Williams has opened up on his relationship with Jerry Horner, then Hallowell, in a new self-titled Netflix documentary about his life, set to launch on Wednesday. He revealed that, at a time when he struggled to form comfortable close relationships, the woman formerly known as Ginger Spice had become a huge ally. However, he admitted that suspicion started to set in after a paparazzi photographer suggested that Jerry was setting up publicity opportunities by letting slip the locations where they would be, something he says he no longer believes. It was a very confusing relationship, because Shush is a girl and I'm a boy. We are very good friends, trying to sort out the wreckage of the past, Robbie reminisced. During the screening of his documentary on Netflix, viewers will be able to catch sight of previously unseen intimate footage from the trip, unraveling exactly why he enjoyed her company. Robbie even co-wrote a song, along with Guy, called Eternity, documenting the time they spent together. It isn't the first track Guy has helped Robbie create, with some of his biggest hits, including Angels, Millennium, Let Me Entertain You and Rock DJ also being co-written by the pro-songwriter. I had a friendship with our ginger that meant a lot to me, in a time when I felt I didn't have any relationships that I felt completely comfortable with, he explained. However, it turned sour for him when he struggled with a lack of privacy on their dates. Wherever we went the paparazzi were there before we got there. We were dumbfounded how this could be happening, he exclaimed in frustration. I bumped into a guy that was paparazzi. He told me it was Jerry doing that, informing the photographers where they'd be. I don't think that's true for one second, but at the time I did believe it. On one particular tour, I introduced it by saying, I am very fortunate to have been in Take That and four out of five of the Spice Girls. That was my intro to the song and it was a joke and the joke went too far. He went on to apologize to all those involved, including husbands and boyfriends who he revealed had become unhappy with the claim.